<laughs> oh, hello there. My name is Robert Gamble. I think today I'll tell you about my cast this past two years. Most of my cast hours, well I shouldn't say most, a lot of my cast hours have come from me helping out coach the neighborhood swim team, the Cedar Field Sharks, 2015 champions! <laughs> Uh, so, yeah, this past summer I decided I would help volunteer for the swim team. Um, I ended up being the coach for the 6 and unders and the 7 eights, which was a great uh, opportunity for me to, to uh, serve my community, and it was another uh, great opportunity for me to, you know, uh, showcase my creativity working with these kids, helping them uh, fulfill their dreams of uh, becoming Olympic athletes. I mean, one kid's name is Ryan, so... We all just called him Ryan Lochte because it just made sense that way. Um, yeah, I mean, I actually think that uh, we had all had a great time. It was great to help them uh, work on their skills in the water in a social, um, competitive environment. Um, and I think I played a really big part in their growth and in my own growth. I realized my skills in uh, helping these kids learn <laughs> uh, how to either grow to be a better swimmer or learn how to swim at all. There were some kids that came in that, I mean, had a, uh, really a skill level of zero, and I was able to help bring them up to compete with some of the other kids. And um, so that was, I mean, it was a really big uh, help to my community because um, I think it's very important, <laughs> I think it's really important for uh, kids to know how to swim and to be good at swimming because swimming's always been pretty important to my life and um, my family's life and I just think it was a really great way to help serve the community and um, also I think it was a great way to show off my creativity because me and some of the other coaches were able to make up different practices, games, we did all kinds of fun activities with the kids to help them learn while having fun at the same time um, and I think that was a great way for me to showcase my creativity every morning uh, me and my other coach, her name was Riley, uh, we would meet at the pool and write up a practice for the kids every morning uh, and it was, this was every morning all of June and the first week of July so this was five weeks about 25 hours each week including the five six hour swim meets that were twice a week so that's a total of like 125 hours split between you know creativity and service so however you want to do that Miss Region uh, <laughs> uh, that's up to you but um, I just think it was a great way for me to showcase my creativity I was able to develop my own skills, work well with others, um, and I do think that it's an issue of global importance for, you know, to help out in your community with kids swimming. <laughs> even, if, even if it was on a local level, I think that it, uh, you know, it makes a big difference in the world for uh, my efforts to have such a great impact on these kids. And like I mentioned earlier, we actually did go on to win. We were the underdogs, but we went on to win. Sophie, what do we win? We were the champions! See? <laughs> so, um, yeah, I just think it was a great opportunity. I had a lot of fun, and I think everyone that I worked with had a lot of fun, and I think it was a great way for me to help serve the community around me and to showcase my creativity.